Hello, fourth year pupils. Hope you're doing fine. Welcome to my channel and welcome to this new video. As we said in sequence two, we have three lessons of pronunciation. We have dealt with triftongs. We have dealt with weak and strong forms of auxiliaries have and has. We're going to deal with was and where later because we are, we're not sure whether they are included in the program or not. Uh, today, we're going to deal with pronunciation of ed endings in the past simple and participle forms of regular verbs. As we said, regular verbs are les verbes les classables ed, le passé simple ou le participe passé. Ou irregular verbs, c'est des verbes qui changent. Let's consider these three examples. Focus on the pronunciation of the words in red. My brother fixed his computer. They moved to Annaba last week. Graham Bell invented the phone. As you may notice, Edie has different pronunciation according to the verb. If I ask you to classify these three verbs in this table according to their pronunciation, here, fixed, this ed is pronounced t. On a dit la lettre est qu'on entre slashes, c'est la prononciation. Il écrit ed, mais la prononciation t est t. Moved, d. Invented, ed. Ici, le ed est prononcé t. Ici, d. Ici, ed. Pourquoi? Why does ed have different pronunciations? Tout simplement, il faut toujours voir la lettre qui vient avant, c'est-à-dire la lettre qui précède le ED. Here we have X. If you got a, a word or a verb with X and then ED, it's pronounced T. Here we have a V and here we have T. Il n'y a pas que ces lettres. Il y a une liste ici, une liste ici et une liste ici. Donc, il faut l'apprendre par cœur. You have to learn it by heart. So, final ED is pronounced in three ways. Either T, D, or ED. When do we pronounce ED as T? We pronounce ED as T after the sounds. Let's focus here on the pronunciation of each transcription. So, P, K, F, F, G H is F too. S, Sh, Ch, X. P like in hoped. K like in walked. F like in breathed. F like in shaft. F like in laughed. S like in kissed. Sh like in wished, Ch like in searched, and X like in fixed. Donc, il faut toujours remarquer Hado. Hado, c'est la transcription. Manta qui fait chier ton trou. Donc, qui tu faut head les lettres qui nous avons le ED, automatiquement la prononciation t'as le ED t'kun T. When do we pronounce ED as D? After the following sounds. B, G, V, R, V, J, J, Z, N, N, L, N, Y, plus all the vowels, diphthongs and triphthongs. We have some examples here. Encouraged. Uh, à coup de semble le ed on le prononce de encouraged enjoyed loved caused preferred i have a remark here here we have got uh, we've got ce c'est écrit ici ce mais la prononciation de c'est ce donc we say caused caused when do we pronounce ed as it. We've got just two sounds, t and d. 
Alors, qu'il te faut le T avant le ED ou bien le D avant le ED, automatiquement la prononciation de ta id. Invented, tested, exploded, decided. Hadi, c'est la plus simple. Thank you, my dear pupils, for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Take care of yourselves. Goodbye.